All right, guys, today I'm going to show you how to side chain a sample purely with the KO. So this works with sounds that have a decay rate. So it's going to start loud and then it's going to very slowly go quiet. And it's going to work a lot better with sounds that decay very steeply because you're going to get way more apparent effect to play around with. So what we're doing now is we're doing this bass sound. So what we're going to do is take that sound. We're going to chop it into a drum rack and you're going to get all these little chops so what we do now is we go with the trim option we start on sound 16 we drag the trim and we're going to do that for every sound all the way up to one so it's going to sound like this Once you have that done, you take the overall volume and you make it slightly quieter than the kick. And then you go with sound 16, which is nothing. And you're going to throw that on the downbeat. And then you're going to pick a sound a little bit louder. Let's go with that one. That one's going to go one row and then we're going to go a little louder. That's going to go the next row. And then we're going to go louder and that's going to go with the next row and then you're going to get this effect. And another thing is if you're trying to go with just pump, don't use the one because that's a transient, but if you want to add some extra rhythm, make it pop out here and there, you can take the one, you can just have it appear, you can have it appear here and there in the rhythm. So let's go with like basic offbeat. Dun. Let's see. Hope you enjoy.